Hello friends, in my previous video tutorial, I showed you the basics of ultrasonic sensor. So in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you the basics of ultrasonic levitation. And also I'm showing how to build a model ultrasonic levitator. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. So what is ultrasonic levitation? Ultrasonic levitation is a technique used to lift or float objects in air using ultrasonic sound. First let's see how this works. We have two ultrasonic transmitters to transmit ultrasonic waves. This wave will interfere with each other and we get a new standing wave with the anti node and node. The pressure at node is higher than the anti node and also the force is greater in nodes because force is proportional to pressure. If we place an object in between node and anti-node, the object experiences a little bit lift. That's the working principle of ultrasonic levitation. So let's build our levitator. First of all, we need to generate and transmit ultrasonic waves. For that, we need some ultrasonic transmitters. So I took this ultrasonic module and removed the control board. Now I have one transmitter and one receiver. The receiver also perform like transmitter so we don't care about that. Now I removed the protective casing of all transmitters. Now you can see the transmitting disc. Now I took two small common PCB and placed the transmitter and also solder wires for transmitters. I did the same for the second transmitter. After that, using a long bolt, I placed the transmitters. Follow the same if you are planning to replicate. After making this structure, let's set up the controller side. We need a motor driver to drive transmitters, Arduino. Also, we need a power supply. I am using 7.4 volt lithium ion battery. You can download circuit diagram from my blog, link is in the description. The circuit is very simple. Controller send 14 kHz signals to driver and the driver amplify that signals. That's all. You can hear a noise after turning on the circuit. First I took a small thermocol ball and tried to levitate that. You can see here, I failed to levitate that object. Then I decreased the size of the thermocol ball and tried again. After trying some time, you can see the result, it works.
Honestly saying we can lift even a mustard C with this setup. Now let's do some other experiments to increase the levitation. My first assumption was we can increase the levitation by increasing the number of transmitters. To prove that I took 3 more ultrasonic module and took 6 transmitters. Then I build the setup again and you can see the result nothing happened but this setup worked for some other makers so maybe some reason with my design. Next my thought was to increase the energy of the wave by increasing the driving voltage. Previously I used 7.4 volt lithium ion battery. Now I shifted that 7.4 volt to 14.8 volt. But result is the same. Failed again. So let's end the experiments here. If you have any working ideas about to increase the levitation, please comment it below. So that's all about today. Hope you enjoyed and learned something about ultrasonic levitation today. If so, please like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.